my shirt? No, I've always had the shirt. It's mine. Oh my galactic overlord. I bought that for my birthday. Give it back. No, it's mine. Uh, yeah, right. Uh, yeah, it's mine. It's always been mine. I don't no, it hasn't. Don't you remember last, like, last year I came home with that shirt in a gift bag you and you were just kids these... better stop bickering or I'm going to kick you out. Buzz out, lady. <laughs> FYI, my birthday's coming up in one month. You better buy me a present. It doesn't seem like it's my problem. Sounds like more of it's your problem since you bought the shirt. Well, then give it back. No, 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 no. It's mine, and it's always been mine. Not true. That's a lie. You two No, 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 It won't happen again, Miss Judge. That won't work this time. You've disrupted the peace on Tanat for the last time. What's, What's our, our punishment? punishment? I'm banishing you to Earth. No, no, not Earth! Just send her, don't send me. What? It was totally your fault. <laughs> Now, look what you did. You made so much trouble to my future resume. You're kidding me, right? Nowadays, everything that you do seems to be my fault. I mean, you borrowed my favorite earrings and you broke them and then you come to me and say that I must have done it myself. Do you think that I could forget that you borrowed them like 17 days ago? 17 days seems like a little specific and like they were my earrings to begin with and then like you borrowed them first so like they're mine, okay? No. Yeah, no, they're so they mine. They're, mine. They're, no, they they're, are mine. mine. They're, they're mine. They're mine. No, it's your fault. No, it's your fault. Your fault. It's your fault. Whose house is this anyway? that they're like Earth's energy fuel. Mint wisdom flavor? Hmm, can I have one? Finders, keepers, losers, weepers. I think you mean finders, keepers, finders, weepers. But they're so good, you have to try one. I don't know. Oh. I am the Tic Tacs, the keeper of all Earth's wisdom. You two must find a way back home. Do you want to build a rocket ship? Wait, are you sure that's what the Tic Tacs meant? How else are we supposed to travel galaxies? Fools, it'll never work. Did you hear that? You don't have the brains or the ability to work together and build this rocket ship. We'll show you, tiny potato man thing. Hardy har har. You don't think that this will work, do you? My cousin Tina's three dogs have eaten more chocolate than you have brain cells, and dogs are allergic to chocolate. Why did we bring him? Okay, hopefully this slingshot will work because your rocket didn't work. You, my friend, are crazy. The girl is right. Your brain is the size of my hamster Coco's brain. Why did we bring him again? Anyway, three, two, one. Ugh, of course it wouldn't work, you idiot. That was your stupid idea. Yeah, but I thought you would have forgot. Go 
search for Cape Corn on the comm, and there you'll find a building called NASA. Hijack a spaceship and don't get caught. Who knew it would be this easy to break into NASA? How do we work this thing? I need a Tic Tac. The Tic Tacs will tell us. Mm -hmm. Still tell us that his uncle out toys. We should give him a try. Yeah. Let's see. Just try to get along. Apologize to each other. Trust in the mints. I'm so sorry, you have Olivia. Can you accept my apology? I accept your apology. And I'm sorry too. But we have to be nicer to each other. Agreed. That's all you had to do, girls. How do you feel? Space tastic. <laughs> Thank the Lord for Tic Tacs. I know, right? You have nice hair today. Uh, they're antennae. I'm sorry, I'm not used to being this nice. Settle it over a Tic Tac? Yeah.